Hey guys, it's John and welcome back to my playthrough of Alan Wake 2. I think this is part 6, but honestly, it doesn't matter that much to me. Let's ask Alan if he's heard of the Cult of the Tree. Have you ever heard of the Cult of the Tree? Creepy bunch, in the habit of wearing deer masks, performing murder rituals, victims turning into monsters possessed by darkness, possibly inspired by a horror story written by a certain author. Hmm? Man, he Rainy hates him. Bells. Cult. Yes. Yes. They have the clicker. Are they working with Scratch? Mr. Scratch. If the cult has the clicker, does that make them Scratch's followers? How are you so certain they even have the clicker? They could be working for Scratch. I, I don't remember. It's all confused. Alan, if I'm going to act on this information, you need to be honest with me. Yeah, of course. Is he confused? Or is he hiding something? We'll have to check in our mind palace. Under profiling the cult and the clicker. Wait, the cult has the clicker. How does he know? The writer is the reader. The next chapter, the next chapter, the next chapter. Keep hmm. the pages safe, the dark shining of the words. Wake is hiding pages. That's how he knows the cult has the clicker. He's hiding the pages. Wake has a double. Mr. Scratch. Where is he now? A cloud of wrath wears my face. The dark place in your place. Scratching out my body of work. Scratch is here. In Washington. He's hunting Wake. I mean, are we sure that we're with Alan Wake right now and not Scratch? Scratch looks just like Wake. Mm. Why? Don't wake up the dreamer if your life is a dream. I swam to the shore, but the water is rising. Wake and Scratch are clearly connected. Maybe Scratch got out because Wake did. Or vice versa. Hmm. Yeah, I'm not, uh, I'm not totally convinced. But let's confront him about the information we somehow know. About information that he somehow knows. This game is full of a lot of people who just somehow know something. Okay, Mr. Wake, I know you have more pages of the manuscript on you. You don't understand how vital these pages are. They're the only way I can know what's coming. You're not the only one trying to solve this. Yeah, I want you to share the info. This don't be so selfish. This is our job. Okay. Here. Yeah, thanks. This is all I have. Be careful with them. Okay. Uh, don't worry, I'm just gonna store them safely in my mind palace. Inside the trailer, at the outskirts of Watery, Saga had seen Wake's fabled clicker for the first time in the hands of the cult of the tree. A cultist stared at her. She drew her weapon. That's it. The trailer. Okay. That's it. We said multiple pages. You're hiding multiple pages. You give me one. And it's like the shortest one ever. Well, oh, story of my mind palace. You know, I, uh, <laughs> there was somebody who commented, I think it was on like part two or something. And they were like, they were, they were dead serious. They were like, it's, Mind place, not mind palace. Whoa, get it right! Oh, that's so entertaining. Some people, uh, some people, you're just like, do you have any self awareness at all? None? None at all? Do you have any? Look at this pumpkin right here. Wait, there's another one. There's lots of pumpkins around here. Wake has more information. I need to keep questioning him. I know you got you you got you guys a lot of the time are just like they were trolling, they were trolling, they want you to respond. They well, you played right into their hand. They tricked you. I promise you after twelve years of doing this. Some people are fucking serious about it. They're serious. They're not trolling, they're just not very socially adept. Do I go on the case board maybe? Oh, okay. Let's see. The story. Okay. Oh. 
Wake just gave us a lot of information. Not really that but much. This clicker seems like a good place to start. Yeah, remember Nightingale wanted that, it too? Then we find the cult. Remember he was talking about it? How come you haven't mentioned it yet if you remember? Okay, can't say I understand all this, but if Wake is telling the truth, then his magic light switch is the most tangible lead. Let's start there. I also I will also say too, gamers are like are like the kings and queens of taking something like like making making a little tiny molehill. Little tiny molehill and, and, and making it into like a gigantic Mount Everest mountain. They're the kings and queens of doing like, like just a little bit of gameplay. They they take it so seriously. They're just like, how could you? How could you call it Mind play, uh, Palace? It's not, that's not what it's called. You think it's funny? You think you're funny, funny man? Standing inside the trailer at the outskirts of Watery, Saga had seen Wig's fabled clicker for the first time. Where is the clicker? Trailer? The cult of the tree is in position of the clicker. The cult of the tree has the clicker Wake told me about. They're okay. a part of all this. What? No shit. The cult. I think the cult might be involved somehow. <laughs> Something tells me. The cult could be followers of Scratch. They have the clicker after all. Uh, sure. Sure. Love the confidence. Why work for Scratch? What does the cult get out of it? Wait, do I have something more for the story? Oh. The pages we've been finding are from a horror story called Return, written by Alan Wake. And the contents of this book are coming true. Why couldn't it have been a romance? Oh, 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 oh. oh, 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 oh. oh we got... Okay, the story... Changes our reality bit by bit. The process is gradual. That means the effect isn't immediate. There's still time to fix this. Fiction coming into contact with the dark place has the power to change reality. I like how I like how for Alan Wake 2, basically the whole point of this case board is to be like, are you getting it? Do you understand what's going on? Because <laughs> otherwise, I'll be honest, it's helping me a little bit. No shame. So whatever you write in the dark place becomes reality. It can't be that simple. If we don't stop it, Scratch will use the story to permanently change reality at the start of Deerfast. Hmm. Oh, sorry. Oh, okay, this is... I didn't see that we had this. Turn the world into a fucking nightmare. That only gives us two days to stop this. Oh! Fiction coming in contact with the dark place can change reality. The story I knew, is coming true. I knew you could click it, but I didn't know that anything would happen. Last time, it didn't happen all at once. Okay. The story Mu came true bit by bit as it unfolded. Let's get the clicker before Scratch. With it, the story can be changed, and Scratch will be sent back to the dark place. The clicker. Yeah. How do you have so much red string? A magic light switch. Where do I even start with that? Some other strange reality, the dark place, merged with ours. This place and the dark place... The page called this area an overlap. Right. <laughs> right, we've been to the overlap. Where Wake was. I heard the Cauldron Lake overlap are reciting the poem. Right. The, f the fiction of the poem. About a local legend, a witch's lost heart. About terror. Terror. Wake was trapped in the dark place for 13 years. Yeah, but like, was he really though? I don't know about that. Wake was in another world that entire time. Maybe not the entire time. There's an entity inside the dark place called the Dark Presence. <clears throat> According to Wake, the Dark Presence can sometimes take his appearance. How? Why? Interesting. Dark Presence. Find evidence. Yeah, no shit. Oh, if you just click on it. Oh, it tells you, like... Look how much are, are there. Okay. Flashlight seems to weaken Taken. I don't know. Uh, makes sense. Okay. It would make sense that light is effective against the Dark Presence too. Yeah, but you can't assume that. This is like a minor, like a minor, minor little nitpick. Little, I'm making a little mountain out of a molehill myself. I'm a hypocrite. But 
a lot of times in these games with these complicated stories and lore and mysterious, you know, environments and worlds and stuff, they, they often, like, make a big assumption that would be unsafe to scientifically make, and they're just right. Because, like, they're, they're probably right. Light probably does affect the dark presence, but it's like... You can't make that assumption, you know, just it just annoys me because it, it's done in like all media. Movies, TV shows, whatever. It's like whatever the writers decide, they just make a character say that and then it's true. But whatever, you know, you got you, you can't you can't have them just be scratching their heads like, oh, we can't assume anything. Cause that's that's boring. So I get why they do that. Inside a bright light, Saga felt safe, like nothing could hurt her here. Hmm. We're, we're, what, here? Well-lit areas are safe from the Dark Presence and the Taken. In the form of Scratch, the Dark Presence is editing Wake's story. Wants to turn the world into a fucking nightmare. So that goes here, right? Right. Okay, well, I obviously can't let that happen. Great, thank you. you double edited it into a horror story that's now changing reality, taking over people. Scratch and the Dark Presence are interchangeable. When the Dark Presence looks like Wake, it goes by the name Scratch. An evil twin is a bit convenient. I'll keep an eye on it. Yeah, true. This says for later. Okay. So, I mean, I guess, I guess we're all good here. It's all on the page. The clicker. The cult. Okay. I'll head to Watery and find this trailer. I like her Casey, soft you shocking. stay here and keep an eye on Mr. Wake. Got it. No, you need me there. No dice, pal. This is an FBI investigation, and I don't see a badge on that flannel. <laughs> he hates him. From now on, you can switch between Alan and Saga's stories via the bucket in the janitor's break room. Feel free to play in whatever order you choose. So this is what they meant by non-linear, because, you know, when they sponsored the video in part one, they said it was non-linear. And, and... You know, so far for the first like five hours of the game or whatever, I was like, what are they talking about? That makes sense. Okay. Right, but how do I know how to do that? You know, one thing I want to comment on too is that the game's mocap is awesome. Like, super massive could take a page or two, you know, no pun intended, out of their book. Okay. Past favorite Deer Fest floats. Go. The yarn puppet monstrosity. The stuffed moose and squirrels one. No, thank you. Those beady dead marble eyes still give me Stop looking at me. Alright. Can I join? I want to sit down right here. Is that okay? I, li I like when you walk past NPCs that like you're supposed to like... Like most players are just like, Let's go investigate! And they just they, they hear them... A oh. hundred bucks says there will be a... So you're supposed to be like, Well, I'm going into the next direct uh, linear coffee area. Ooh, coffee, coffee World. Amusement park. All of but our yeah. attractions are family friendly and available to children of all ages. You are so Just bored. Coffee. So, take a sip of our Oh Dear Diner organic coffee and let the adventure begin! Hold on for dear life on the Espresso Express! Oh! Soak in some local history at the Huatari Well, where two serial killers once hid the disemboweled bodies of their murder victims. Hmm. Uh, it's not haunted. No. <laughs> Come join Mocha Moose and the goats at our amusement park petting zoo. Just don't share your coffee with the goats. <laughs> Seriously, stop feeding our goats coffee. Seriously. It's not a moving. Take in amazing views from the slow road through Ferris wheel. I can almost see the watery lighthouse trailer park. This is so much fun. And finish off at our beautiful gift shop where seniors and children under 10 receive a 9% discount on keychains and propane tanks. Welcome to Coffee World. We guarantee you'll jaw a great time. This is the 
third time I've requested something be done. You know what's great? We can watch that commercial it's anytime we want in our mind itself. palace. It's keeping me awake all night. This poor guy. Yes, sir, I'm terribly sorry for that. Uh, Abe Lincoln over here is really upset. Electrician. In the meantime, um, so all right. My full kid along. Jules, you didn't forget to pack the oh, EMF reader, did you? Look Why at this. Pack your gear? The EMF reader? You guys are ghost hunters? Now how am I supposed to measure the energy signatures emitted by paranormal manifestations? Oh my god, you dorks. That's funny though. That's good. Another one oh. of those cult boxes. What? It's just right here. Oh, you need a code though? Oh. I did it. That was really difficult. Fear the dark, fear the woods. Okay, I'm taking that. I'm taking that. I'm taking that. Thanks. Watch this. I'm turning it off. You can't turn it off. Run. Run the scariest thing in the game. Copyright claims. Can I go through here? Oh, it's padlocked. Is that a chainsaw or a weed whacker? I think it's a weed whacker. Somebody's doing some yard work. Gonna talk over it, la 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 la. You can't hear the, the song, the copyrighted song possibly. I Ooh. need bolt cutters. Oh. I sound like Alfred from Bloodborne just now. Oh. I'm just sitting here fishing. What do you want to do today? What I do every day, fish out on the dock. You know, I'm going to complain because it's my favorite thing to do, but, um, I hate on the controller when you put you have to push the stick in to run because unless you keep up that exact amount of pressure which is like kind of kind of crazy for long periods of time you just stop running I need Look. something to cut this bolt cutters take care now who are you talking to me Look at this guy he is grumpy Arr. I don't like, I don't like you guys. Hey there. Hey there. Hi. Coffee World. Deer Fest. Um. Oh. Sorry. Track down the clicker and watery. Drive to watery. Now I could do that. What? The Oh Deer Diner over here. Right. And then there's downtown. There's not really anywhere to go. I mean, I guess we could just go, well, there's a point of interest there, to the car or whatever. Conversation, new choices. Is it so? I want, don't tell me the bookers are still at the diner. Let's check. Let's check it. Hi there. I'm just reading a newspaper. Are the Yo, bookers, have you eaten your pie? We are going to Akuga's house to drink some No whiskeys. way. Are you coming? No, Ilmo. I'm very busy wearing a turtleneck and drinking wine like an asshole. Oh dear, I know what Yakko needs. I'm a beer to the rescue. How many businesses do you guys own? Bring out your inner Wolverine with I'm a beer. You guys have a lot of enterprises, huh? Wow, this is the best party ever. Thanks, I'm a beer. Alma beer is a traditional Finnish lager, and we drink it the Finnish way. At the bar while actively avoiding small talk with strangers. <laughs> How true. Getting blackout Fair drunk on a boat during midsummer and trying not to drown. In the sauna, using your beer can to hide your bippeli from wandering <laughs> eyes. I see. Partaking in the Finnish tradition of kalsarikämmit. Drinking at home alone in your underwear with no intentions of going out. It's not sad if it's intentional. Alma beer, your finished drinking adventure starts here. You know, these are long commercial spots. 
They're they're paying for a lot of runtime. And then what I love too is that the TV's just blank afterwards. It's like we're all done. Welcome hey, to the oh dear diner. I where was that? Where's that chick? All oh, right. Very uh, read that. Um, where's that chick that was like, "Ooh, your daughter's so, dead." So I'm thinking of pre-gaming at my place before. Pre-gaming. I'm thinking of pre-gaming. Did they not know what pre-gaming is? I'm thinking of pre-gaming. They said it like a boomer. You got any Pokemon cards here? And can you pause the game? Pause the game. It's time for dinner. I'm thinking of pre-gaming. I need to go back. No. Got a case to solve. No, but what if we explored? Oh, it won't let us. Zero out of ten game. Ran into an invisible wall. Is there? Is there like? What? Hang on. I want to rebind Sprint. Can I do that? Okay. Because holding in the left stick is about to make me turn to the Joker. Okay, so A, X, B. Okay, what if... Okay. How about... That's B. Flashlight is left stick. Ah. Uh, that just feels better. Now you might say, what about in combat situations where you're running? Well, I mean, it's really easy to just stop holding down the button, so. Ah, uh, that's much better. I'm so happy now. Holding down left stick is just, How's it's it not going? my style. Yeah, don't talk to me. Don't fucking talk to me. Is this the point of interest? What's the point of interest? There's a point of interest right here. Can I? Oh my god. It's like right here. So is it on the other side of this? It says it's like here. Is there like, it's not like an upstairs, is there? Is it this? Cause look, it acts like it's, is it the map? Cause we've already got the map. I don't know, man. All right, let's just, uh, let's just leave. I'm gonna continuously take out my uh, flashlight because I'm gonna forget that that's not sprint anymore. Yeah, Anderson, I didn't want to say this in front of Wake, but are you sure this is a good idea? Going on your own? Assuming we believe the page, I need to check this out. We need to find the cult. Anyone we meet here could be a member. And this scratch guy. The evil doppelganger? It must be true, or else this guy can't write for shit. The quality of his writing aside, if this page turns out to be true like the rest have, this could be a breakthrough. We might solve this thing before a backup even arrives. Yeah, but they're taking their time, so just be careful out there. Meanwhile, I think me and Wake will have a chat. Maybe I can shake something loose. Okay. But remember what happened with the salt shaker. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, real funny. The page placed me in a trailer somewhere in Watery. I should ask around. Local girl! Sick, dude. Okay, so this is um similar looking like Port Town, but it's a little... Is that Mr. Door? A no. Vote for sorry. Mayor Setter. Is That's a, a mayor. For every, for watery. I thought he was wearing glasses at first. Mayor Setter will stand up for justice. Hmm. Interesting. So 
So this must be a really small town. <laughs> I'm guessing. The bloody mouth twists into a grin. The cap of the booze bottle has gone missing. Where are you, where are you reading this? Where, where are you reading that? Fresh fish. I thought that said flesh for a second. I'm seeing all sorts of things. I'm seeing Mr. Door. I'm seeing the word flesh on a sign. The flooding I need to calm is even down. worse here. More like underwatery. Oh, that's a good one. I'll have to tell Casey that one later. Oh, I see. Yeah, the dock is underwater. Underwater. Do not feed the fish. No catch and release. Cook what you catch. Oh, missing dog. Hey, what did you used to say your dream job was as a kid? Um, detective. I bet it wasn't dock worker. No, it wasn't. You're right. That. Oh, you're talking right. to her. Y'all are like are an unnatural so. distance apart well, for this conversation. Appreciate you all, at least. I was like, why are you talking to me? Why are you asking me what I wanted to be when I grew up? A detective is the answer. And I've achieved my lifelong dream. Okay. Aww. Remedy was like, we don't want people going up there. It explodes out and rages in the night. Oh, that's music. I didn't see the music notes. Because when she came over here and it said like, the mouth twists into a bloody grin. I was like, what? That's really weird. There's a lost cat, by the way. Is something eating household pets around here? What do you think? Yes. It could rain soon. Very good. Ah. One way to tell if it's raining is to simply put my hand out and feel. Looks like it's still not raining. Better check again, right? Gotta make sure. Oh, no, it's not raining still. Nope, did you look at your hand? There's no water on it. How about now? Wow. What a life these people lead, huh? Swomi society. Okay. What what is that? Just like a piece of bread or something? Damn. This is depressing. Do you guys even have any coffee? Hello. Do you have a second? Ah, long time and no see, Miss Anderson. Uh, Tor and Odin are not here. They are huh? old tricksters always sneaking off. Sorry, no, I, I wanted to ask you about something else. I'm looking for a trailer. Can you point me to any trailers around here? Sure. Watery Lighthouse Trailer Park. Yilmo Koskel owns it. Yilmo. Owns many things in town. Yeah, no, I've and noticed. Where is I saw Yilmo and his brother at the bridge. Well, what used to be the bridge. Oh, are they building a new business there? Are you from around here? Do you live around here? I live in Bright Falls. You oh. see me around. I am Mr. Blum. You call right. me Vladimir. I work at the nursing home. I take care of your old people. We are on day trip, music, sauna, the good times. I bring them here in the bus. The elderly are very important. I forgot. It's a very nice bus. Thanks. Valhalla Nursing Home. Hi. Wait. Hi. Can I help you? <laughs> okay, let's just talk about something real quick. Valhalla Nursing Home. And he was talking about Tor and Odin. God, if this was a Netflix show, I'm just saying you guys would be like, this is bad writing. Bad writing, plot hole. Val Hall, am I supposed to believe there's a Val Hall nursing home and then okay, Odin then. and Thor there? Come on. Tune. I'm just saying. What is the janitor? That's him. Hello there. Wait, that's the... the first FBI agent to ever get shushed. She's from the diner, isn't she? What's her name? It's, it's Rita, isn't it? 
No, Rose. Rose Marigold. Is that her is that is that her name at the diner? Was it Rose? I can't remember. Okay, oh here we go, a map. Watery. Let's take a look at it. Oh wow. Watery's huge. We're downtown right now. Downtown sucks. <laughs> downtown actually not that crazy. There's not that much to do here. Oh, 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 ammo. Oh, okay, battery. You know, it would make sense that there isn't, like, gun ammo in the bathroom here. Kickstarters? Just kidding. I'm sure, you know what? If you want to look for a name, if you want to look through all the names, you can pause it. Hang on, let me, let me see if it... Oh, no, it doesn't change if I have the flashlight out. Is this Watery, Watery's own Nessie? An anonymous source sent this photograph to our editors, claiming it was captured during the last full moon. Oh, I see it. You can like barely see it. It's kind of dark. A majestic beast hidden in the depths of the water or an elaborate pla uh, prank? A sea creature that defies the very laws of nature or a submarine relic from the Cold War era. A lonely wanderer searching for companionship and compassion or a fearsome monster out for blood. These questions among others oh, haunt our editorial team here at Bright Falls Record after one of our avid readers sent in this mysterious photograph as evidence of an unidentified creature roaming watery's waters and making a rare but opportune appearance. This titillating spotting might just be the event of the year. As we dive deeper into this mystery, we here at the Bright Falls Record invite all our readers to a naming competition. What should our local beast be called? Watery Wanda? Shelly the Sea Monster? Send in your suggestions now! More updates and revelations to follow as the story unfolds. Coffee World Amusement Park. We've already heard all about that. I don't really need to hear more about it. We, we watched an entire commercial. Oh, look at that. Switch Reality. Oh, the janitor bucket. The bloody mouth twists into a grin. You know what? Let's try it. Let's try it. Why not? That's cool. I wasn't able to escape. That's cool that you could just go the back and forth like that. Me. Now can 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 I switch from Alan to Saga as well, or are we just screwed? I will oh, you write a new draft of initiation to reach Parliament use Tower using another murder site. Scratch was reaching out from the dark place to get Alice. She was out, but still in danger. Back here. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Our guest tonight is Alan Wake. This time, again, something. I was back, and I hadn't Doug, forgotten. Is, this is I crazy. This now. I could take I, control. I like this. No more surprises. I like that you could just go back and forth. That's pretty sick, actually. I like that. The old gods of Asgard? Valhalla Nursing Home? The song is called Herald of Darkness, but I like to call this next segment the story of the journey of Alan Wake, the musical. Look at Sam Lake getting down the over chat, there. But instead of talking, we'll sing it. Do we want to go in? Hell yeah, we do. Let's do it. What? What the hell? From 
what I gathered. You grew up nice and sheltered with mama's what? stories and your own made up fury. And mama gave me a magic clicker. Well, yes, I think it's true and fair to say. What? No, I know. I get it. I get it. I'm going. Yeah, let's run. Well, I get to the next part. So Mr. Dork, quite theatrical. I'm gonna have to tell Kenny about this. <laughs> Holy shit. Man, so you were drawn to stories early on. My dreams would light up my imagination. And you had nightmares night and day. Yeah, but with the clicker, I chase those frights away. Who you? So true. So here is the clue of hope to remember. Visions, they come true. A band of lights will <laughs> yeah, it's not that song either. Actually, I'll just tell you them later. <laughs> I'm guessing you're not a fan of it, Alan. Take the light with the clicker. Wow.
No, I'm going. I'm going. I, I. It's just I'm taking it all in. Okay. I'm taking it all in. Are we going straight to the phone or to the getaway club? club? I never meant for it to ruin my life that way. Would you say you let the jaded lie? Dark shades could never save the day. So sad, but true. Wait, wait. Is it over here? No charges. Oh, I thought I took the light. No? Getaway club is this way. See, that's fine. Welcome to Bright Falls. Okay, we gotta get a light somewhere. So we can get out of here. Oh, here we go. That took me an embarrassingly long time to find. Whoa, whoa. Here we go. Wow, here we go. Okay. I'll stay up this time. Oh. Getting a little somber here now, huh? Let's take it down a notch. Time for a ballad. Tom Zane, right? Right, that's why the janitor was calling him Tom. Just one shot, one more chance for him to save their marriage away from the city. A romantic girl. Oh, this is cool. It brought the stage to me. There we go. Oh, the flare gun. Six. Still he's a torch bearer, and it couldn't be much clearer. Oh, I've got a lot of flare gun ammo, okay. all those shots.
We're doing okay. We're doing okay. Reload this. Look at all those batteries. Okay, I'm taking these. <laughs> Take in, get it. We're gonna take it right now. Oh, sure. Get a headshot. Is that the mayor? What the hell is he doing here? Okay. Oh no! This guy right here. Or this girl, sorry. Got me trouble. I'm not actually restoring health. I thought I got that upgrade where if I shine light on somebody, I restore some of my health. No? Enemies are this way, thanks. Okay, now. Oh, painkillers. Oh, can I use it? Let's let's quick slot that here. Oh yeah, I'm feeling much better now. I should have been using these. Um, okay, this way now. My bad. Oh, we've got a lot of enemies here. I think. Holy shit! Okay. You know what? There we go, I got two of them. Try to line them up. There we go. Oh, really? Okay. So much action in this part now. Endless guitar solo. <laughs> Here, actually. There we go. Oh, that didn't get both of them? That didn't get both of them either? Diver's Isle, okay. Well, hopefully we can get there. Take all, there's a ton of enemies here. Safe, is that true? Light about to go out? Oh, I should have maybe tried to get there. I could have cut him off. Okay. It's the typewriter and I guess we go into the TV, yeah? Well, assuming that it's over. I didn't see that coming. Yeah, I didn't either. Wow. A vision. Oh. Oh, we're just gonna go back. We're just gonna go back to regular shit now, huh? We're. No. No, it's not over. Such a dark place. Am I trapped in here? It's this real I cannot. A manuscript it held a key A vicious cycle I must not surrender to Echo seems to speak out Again and again Until I figure it out To bring this song to its end Wow 
Wow. The crazy thing is they're pulling the music off. Like, it's not just like, ooh, quirky musical. Like, it's actually like pretty good. <laughs> songs and the final chorus brings the song to its climactic end. Its end that's so funny like mr door taking all the credit up there hamming it up why are we in thought this place couldn't get any stranger <laughs> oh my gosh the the jander he knows the song catchy right herald of darkness yeah lost in it does get stuck in your head doesn't it i guess we're not going to talk huh <laughs> it's really this brother's perkel What did he say? End of part. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. Somewhere Bloober team's uh, spine shivers just now. They're like, oh, I thought I heard someone say loops forever somewhere. My ideal world. Okay, uh, well, we're gonna save in here and end the video. But dude, you left three donuts? The nerve. So, yeah. So that happened. He's behind me, isn't he? Um. Yeah, that was crazy. Um. You know what? I really like that they do creative things in this game um, and that they, you know, we're just like, screw it. We're going to have fun. I don't know. I'm liking the game more as I go through it. And there's there's more like experimental parts to it that I'm really liking. I'm liking the FMV. I wasn't expecting that, really. Um, I'm liking the the non-linear aspect of the game where you can just be like, I'm tired of playing a saga. I'm going to play as Alan for a while. You know, like we just hopped over here and did this. It's, it's a nice break from, you know, Twin Peaks, small town investigation, cult shenanigans to just be like, I'll go to the other world and, um, have a musical number sung at me for 40 minutes. I don't know. It wasn't that long, but crazy. Yeah. Uh, yeah, I'm really, digging this i like the attitude i think more than anything i like the attitude and the atmosphere um the gameplay for me is still a little bit like eh, probably the weakest part of it but i think everything else is making up for it so far and more and more it's it's making up for it more and more i guess all right let me know what you uh, thought about this video and the game and uh the series so far and i'll see you in the next one think critically <laughs>